Hey, y'all, it's Val and Sweet Hunter. So Sweet Hunter got up this morning and said, let's go to Ella J, Georgia. So we're eating lunch at the Canterbury Restaurant. And from there, we went to Mountain Aquatics. It's a pond supply store where we purchased some fish for our pond. We also went to Ace Hardware. Uh, it's my favorite Ace Hardware in Ella J, Georgia, but I missed filming that. But uh, we wanted to take you along with us getting some fish for our pond. We've got a moss problem, so we're trying to solve it. Hope you enjoy. Oh, I like these. As you can see, a lot $1, of these females dollars are, a piece. Mm -hmm. A lot of these females are full of eggs, too. Oh, wow. Yeah. Well, I mean, why are they so expensive? It's because they are premium fish. A lot of these have been imported, but it's based on their confirmation and then their pattern. Oh, my And their God. size. I mean, the okay. size helps. But these are show quality fish. Oh, yeah. We don't need yeah. that. That's out of our leg. <laughs> <laughs> They're good for six hours in the bag. Okay, good. Wow. And this is grass cart. Sterile grass cart. No, it don't. Yeah, that's why you don't have to put more water in there. Oh, in the bag? Yeah. You don't need any more water. Yeah, I'm saying, oh. I can't believe it. You don't have to put any more than that. No, but it's just the two gallons just to kind of keep them damp so they don't dry out. But there's mm. oxygen. It's 100% oxygen that goes in yeah. the bag. And, you know, these are the most dramatic fish that we have. Um, sometimes when they're in the bag, they get really angry. They'll roll over on their side and act like they're dying. They're not. They're fine. They swim away. They're just dawn queens. I don't see them. <laughs> wow. Those are big. These are a large catfish. But like I said, Well, just anywhere? Yeah. You can probably put them right up there in the back in the corner. Mm-hmm. Really? It won't hurt it? No, it won't hurt them at all. It can't squish them because they're in the bag with oxygen. Oh. Wow. Get it. Red leaf sundew. You see all the bugs on it? Yes. Oh, mm -hmm. man. And so it eats bugs. Mm-hmm. And you like. see the strands are sticky? Yeah. Yeah, the bugs just stick to it and it digests them. So can you do that in a garden? You can, you can have them everywhere. Wow. Um, these, the bugs go down inside the traps. There's really small hairs and they can't climb back out and the traps digest them. Oh my goodness. And how much are these? These start at 14 and go up to 60. Depending so when on you the size say 14, container. like just one of those blooms? Mm -hmm. And it'll be wow. in a small one gallon pot. So like this? So these are all 22. Mm -hmm. And this is a Saracenia flava. It's the largest variety that we have. It grows three feet tall. Wow. But they're wicked smart plants. They'll kick off their flower so the pollinators can come and pollinate. And then as the flower is dying, they start setting up their traps so they don't actually eat the pollinators. Well, that's cool. 
That is. Thank you for sharing. You're that. very welcome. It's a it's an amazing design. It like, really you is. Have to appreciate it. You yeah. Know? Yeah. Are you in sticker shock? Yeah. Like everything else. So what? Tell them what we got. Uh, we got the uh, ten grass car, about a foot long, which overlaid the uh, the uh, moss out of the pond, because I'd rather have those than I had to put stuff in the water to try to kill it. But that, and then uh, I wanted two goldfish, so we got a couple of big old foot long goldfish, but in late. I'll have to warn those grandkids, they better not catch them. Grass carps at them prices. <laughs> them off what were they? How much? Sixteen dollars. Twelve there. fish at sixteen dollars yeah. piece. I and, I, and we ate lunch. Yeah, I figured it's two or three dollars a piece. Yeah, you know what? We ate lunch out too. Yeah. <laughs> Everything we do is so expensive, and now it rains on our way home. them up. So there's five in each bag and see all this moss? That's what he's got these for. They're grass carp, right?
we had another pond at another farm one time and I had two goldfish and nobody remembers them but me and so I wanted to make sure and get goldfish and I wanted them big enough where the big bass couldn't eat them I think the kids will enjoy seeing these if they catch them they better not hurt them so we got one two three how long do they have to sit out, Sweet Hunter? She said 15 minutes. You don't really think the cats should be that long. Look at the Martins. Let's see. Turn that off. So we can hear the Martins. Look, they're right above us. I love hearing them. Goodness, they are wanting them out. They're pushing through the plastic bag. Been 15 minutes yet? I hope so. They're wanting loud. Look at them. Oh, they got them all. There's the mailman now. Yeah, we'll go up there and get that. Kill a few minutes. How are you gonna let them out without a knife? I'm gonna do these rubber bands. You like to get a hundred of them. I'm trying to get rid of them. Whoa! My nail. That's thick plastic. It wouldn't go through it. Oh. What is it you've always said about your pawpaw? Every time I ask him for it, if he had a knife, he'd say, I got my breeches on, don't I? And he always had, if he had his pants on, he had a knife in there. That ain't quite that smart. Yay. I'm trying to get that pill in the bank. I want to see how many is in there. She said five on each bag. Did you count them up? No. Why don't you give us an answer to them? I'll tell you. One, two. Ooh, boy, they're fast. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Right. You see where they went? <laughs> oh. 
Right there went one, and that yeah, moss. Don't get out there with them big bass. I know it. Stay in the moss. I can't afford to buy no more. Second bag. You just like it's supposed to be. Coming right off? Yeah. Just grab that one and it just won't work. They're rolling out, aren't they? Well, it opened right up. Can you see how many? One, two. Three, four, five. See where they go. Can they get through there? Yeah. Get in there and eat that moss. Kick that one or something. Make them go. They're not used to being in that. They're used to being in a tank. Yeah, he's all watered up. Two of them was under there. Dang it, boy. The water's hot. He's asking about that. That ain't moving, honey. Yeah, it is. Let's see. When he wants to. That's $16. Yeah. Just don't want to get tangled up in there. Might need to throw them out a little bit. It's thick right here. Come here, boy. Slick, too. Oh, yeah. They're still in it. Okay. Well, that's what they're made for, right? Be safe there. That way the bass won't leave it. Yeah, I don't want these in the moss. It's thundering. Well, now I got my hands slick that fish on them. Can't grab that. Yep, here it comes. Well, that was the the uh, beginning of our fish stocking, right? Yeah, been a Twelve. busy, busy day. Twelve little fish. Hope they make it. Will they make it? They make it. Okay. They'll be fine. All right. Eat all the moths they want. Hey, y'all. Go cook something. All right. See y'all later. Bye.